Hi, I'm Danny. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I'll be replacing my PCB valve on my 2007 Honda Element. The reason for this is just maintenance. I also purchased one for my Honda Civic. I'll leave a link to that video in the description. According to everything I read, a PCB valve should be checked or replaced approximately every 50,000 miles. My 2007 Element has 126,000 miles. It's never been checked or replaced. A PCB valve's main function is to regulate the flow of vapors during combustion. As your PCB valve wears, it can cause oil to seep into the manifold, causing future problems. And in more severe cases, drivability issues and oil leaks. Replacing the PCB valve on a Honda Element takes about 15 minutes, and it's not expensive to do. I recommend replacing the PCB valve every 50 to 75,000 miles. This just makes sense. Let's get started and get this PCB valve replaced. So first thing we need to do is take off the cover, and it's just a 10 millimeter socket. And it's two nuts. Once that's off, this will just pull up. And like right there, it hooks in there with the two nuts. Next thing we're gonna do is go ahead and get this clamp off. Just a pair of pliers will work on this. And then this hose here, I bought these little picks at Harbor Freight. They're like $6. Makes it a lot easier if you just reach in there and do it. So we're gonna take it off here. Okay, so now if you look down here, there's a clamp holding it on the PCB valve. Uh, it's a clamp just like this. And what I'm gonna use is some needle nose pliers to get down in there. And then I'm just gonna pull it up. And then I'm gonna just use a big screwdriver here. and just kind of pull it off. And there we go. There's the hose. Now it's a 17 millimeter socket on the ratchet. Make sure that's on the off position. Go ahead and get it on there. There it is. Pull it back out and just so from here I should be able to get in here and just unscrew it. So be careful of the washer there. You don't want to lose that washer. So as I come up, see there's the washer. I nearly lost it. It's a little harder than it looks when you're holding a camera. All right, so I've got the washer. And then there's our PCB valve. One quick note, I suggest purchasing the PCB valve from Honda and not purchasing the aftermarket part. This is the Honda part number that fit my 2007 Honda Element and 2009 Honda Civic. All right, now to reinstall the new one, make sure you get this new washer on there. And from here, let's go ahead and get this down. There it is. 
I'm just going to screw that in. All right. And we'll get my ratchet and socket. Let's get that hose back on. There we go. And we'll just clamp, get the clamp back on. Now remember, I'm doing this trying to avoid the cameras, so it should be a lot easier when you do it. And then we just want to get it on. And there it is, it's on. Next, we put our hose in. Put the clamp on. All right, and let's just push the clamp down. Put our cover on, line it up right here. And just line up the bolt holes. Push it in. Take our nuts. Tighten them down. And we're all done. I hope you learned something in today's video. If you did, give me a thumbs up, consider subscribing, and as always, thanks for watching.